go to file select new select part click ok I, I want to go with the millimeter okay and apply scenes whatever you want to select I usually use a plain white go to front plane click sketch select center line and draw a center line along x-axis randomly click select go to circle and select a circle and draw a circle on both the end again one circle over here select a dimension give a dimension to it dimension is 32 mm okay and this dimension to 29 and distance between them distance between them is it is my system is a little slow 110 mm okay all right again draw a line select line and draw a line it should be horizontal okay click and select and then give a dimension to it dimension to this line this line this line should be 11 divide 2 5.50 okay go to mirror select entities okay mirror about this axis we got the click okay all right now you have to you have to select a center point arc okay just draw it randomly you have to draw it randomly all right and uh, select line all right again select line select center line and connect this two point do one thing just select this line and shift and select this line make it perpendicular right again do same thing again do same thing line and this line and make it perpendicular you have to ignore the noise okay now this both the line is and give a this dimension this is 6 mm okay and uh, horizontal gap is is 2 mm and these both have a dimension of 17 mm and here the radius is 13 okay change the direction again we have to select i uh, we have to carry on with the same select uh, sorry select center point r click 
anywhere do select line Firstly, you have to draw again a center line as you have done before. Okay. Okay. Select this and this perpendicular. This and shift, press shift. It will appear you have to give a give it 17 degree okay arc should be 9 right And just select it and drag it down all right and we have the dimension of just 13 all right and one thing we have to do is like off it and place according to we wanted all right like and give a dimension to it this is 6 mm okay and we can place it again we will just and place according to we wanted all right Just go to trim, okay, trim entities, and you have to delete these all. Delete this, delete this, delete this. Nothing. You have to see like trim to close, closest. You have to select that, and just make it delete. Okay, and one is this. It is uh, somehow looking like a wrench. Then click OK. Go to fillet, sketch fillet, and you have to, you know, you have to give 43 mm. Okay, and select this, this, and this. We have done with the uh, with the one part. And again we will go with this part and we will put just 23 mm radius ok and click ok now uh, here we have to change something like go to the tangent arc or a center point and select this go to the tangent arc or or sorry go with the three point arc select this and this and this okay again again select this three point arc okay select this point and this point and click somewhere ok here we have to do one thing is like select the you have to find the center here is the center of this arc okay and here the center of the this are this and this S select this 
and this and make okay and again go to the other part you have to find the this arc center is the center and press shift and click left on this point now we have done with the and fully defined our uh, oh, we have fully defined our drawing exit all right and go to feature sketch click a sketch scooter bus select this and this part and go with, go with the 5 mm all right and mid plane all right click ok again go with the extruded boss go to the sketch and scooted boss go with the 5 mm mid plane all right and select this part this part and we will go with just 4 mm mid plane same this is the our range here we have to give a fillet all right go to the fillet just mention 1 mm and now select the edge here is the edge here is the edge right and here this edge we have all four edges has been selected right click ok here is here we have smooth corn edged ok again go to the fillet and now this time make it 0.3 or 0.5 mm okay select this one this one this one and this one click ok here is our range that we have drawn now if we you want to give any color then go to the go here all right and give a color to it thank you thank you so much for watching and hope so subscribe comment share video thank you so much